And I'm here with Percy. Percy, come on in. The Australian Labradoodle puppy. Hey, boy. Okay, and we've done, been doing loads of work today on just engagement and eye contact, okay? When Percy first came to me, he was an eight week old puppy, all right? So puppies typically at the breeders, they're fed feeding schedules, set times of the day, food goes on the floor. So they're really used to reinforcement coming from the ground, okay? He would scrabble around, excellent, good boy, staying invested in me. Um, good boy. Ah, gently, that was hard. Yeah, nice. So I've had to do a lot of holding the food to his nose, bringing it up to my face and rewarding him for actually looking up at me rather than constantly sniffing the ground trying to look for food. Okay, good boy, come a bit closer. Yeah, good boy. Another thing we can do to start to proof that is holding the food to the side a little. Yeah, good boy. Initially, all dogs will follow the movement of your hands. They're drawn to movement, they're predatory animals, yeah? Good boy. Yes. Yeah. And marking and rewarding the moment that he disengages from the food. Yeah, good boy. Okay. So that he learns to understand that looking at me is is important it's part of the training picture okay so yeah get your dogs engaged it's really normal for puppies to come from the breeder and to yeah good point okay. avoid trying to feed them on the floor because it just feeds into that kind of scrabbling and sniffing around loads we want our dogs to be looking at us and we want to be teaching them that concept really early start looking at me yeah so if you get a puppy that's the first thing you need to start doing, hand feeding it, bringing the food to their nose, up to your face. Yes, mark and reward. As soon as they look at you, um, the more you pair that with, 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 the more you pair that with reward, they're gonna do it again, okay? Yeah, good boy. So, and that happens really quickly. So just get rid of your food bowl when they're really young puppies. Use all of their food allowance for training them. Treat to nose, treat to face. Yeah, good boy, mark and reward, okay? So that you're starting to get a dog that is able to look to you um, and then you can start um, teaching them different behaviours. Luring them into a sit, good boy. That was a big bit of sausage, huh? Luring them into a down. Yeah, good boy, teaching them a release cue. Okay, okay, yeah, good. Teaching them how to follow lures. Yeah, good boy. All of those things are things that you can start doing when your puppy's eight weeks old, yeah? Working on handling with them, taking them out into the environment, teaching them all of the foundations of um, when, they're, when they're ready and fully vaccinated and they're out in the environment. If you put all of that time in, then you're halfway there. Good boy. If we've got a dog that engages with us readily, half the battle's won, okay? Good boy, come here. Good boy. You are really cute. Making sure that they're happy to be touched everywhere, making sure that they're happy to have their collar touched, they're happy to have their harness touched, all of those things that we're desensitizing them to everyday family noises. Are you weeing on me? No, good boy. Um, yeah, so get cracking with all of that, guys, okay? Have my Percy.